I was on the balcony when I heard, baby, baby, come here, see this. It was my brother from the veranda. He had spread himself on an easy chair and our dog, Tom, was dancing round on his hind legs. I burst out laughing. Papa will give medicine to Beta, I said, showing off. And I'll ask Papa to give some medicine to his darling daughter, because... Dot. Because she laughs and laughs, said Baya, tickling me and sending me into fits of laughter. Being the youngest child in the family I received everyone's attention and affection. Papa of course. Was the most affectionate. I ran from one end of the veranda to the other and then onto the balcony, staying close to Papa's room to attract his attention while I played. I swung on the curtain, thumped on the door, tapped on the table, pulled and pushed the chair. Look, Baya, what a variety of sounds they make, I said, pulling the chair, then leaping up and rapping on the door. Clapping my hands, jumping all the while. Don't, pleaded Baya, not taking his eyes off the book in his hand. Racing back to the window of Papa's room, I saw him still busy with the patient. I loved to see him there before me, while I played. He must like it, too, I thought, to see me play around in his room.